Right, we're on. We're back at the beautiful range at Pula Golf Resort, Mallorca. So Pula Golf Club is here in Mallorca. It's 30 degrees. We are early October. Fantastic. Um, some resort. Very impressed. Some of you who have subscribed to the channel will remember that I was here last year, similar sort of time. Um, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Also check out my website, eurekagolfswing.com. And the reason I'm here at Pula Golf Resort is to help you guys with your early extension. And we're talking early extension. What is early extension? Early extension is standing up through impact. Okay, come into impact, standing up. In here at impact, down. There at impact. What's the point in early extension? Well, what does early extension do? Watch this, guess what? Early extension, here we go. It shallows the club, so I attempt to shallow, but what happens from there? It's shallowed, flip, gosh, strikes all over the place. Strike will be all over the place from there because you effectively changed the angle of your spine, which you had at address, which was beautiful. You've altered that into impact. You've straightened your legs and shoved your butt forward. So you've flattened it, stood up, flipped, dumped this club behind you, no use. Okay. So how do we get a good strike from that? We don't, we can't. But how can we get away from early extension? That is something we can do. This golf ball here, let's take a nice clean one. This golf ball here, what I have to do is a dead simple move. You'll really benefit from this. All you've got to do is fire the butt end of the golf club, the butt end, the butt end of that golf club at the golf ball. So you get the top of your swing there, then from there you fire the butt end at the golf ball. But I mean fire right at the golf ball. So if this is my shot here, I'm there, and I'm firing the butt end right down at that golf ball. That's what I'm trying to do. What's it gonna do? Everything has to lower. It's up to the top, and then from there firing the butt end of the golf club down to the golf ball and through the golf ball. Look at my body. I have to come down and meet that ball. I've stood quite tall at a dress, so if I, if I stand tall at a dress, there's more chance of going down. If I'm stooped over at a dress, there's more chance of going up. Early extension up, not forcefully using the ground up. Dress position, good. Up the top, good. And then from there, I'm just going to get the butt towards the golf ball. I'm going to get the butt in towards that golf ball, so I'm there. That's power. There's no early extension in there. I'm really getting down to that golf ball. I'm down there meeting it. I felt there, and you should feel this too. <laughs> I felt there that I, st I was taller at a dress. So I got to the top, freaked out a little bit and thought, God, I need to get back down there. Where is the golf ball? It's down there. I need to go left and down to it. To go left and down to it. So I'm up, going left and down to it, up, and left and down with the butt end of that golf club. And of course, what does it give you? That old thing we talked about in previous videos, right bend, that right bend. In there, right bend, of course. Now, right forearm is in line with the club shaft at impact. Right elbows in front of right hip, and there's forward shaft lean. And what does all that mean? It means everyone's happy. This is a flagpole. <laughs> I can't get it out of the shot. So, rehearse up, butt end of the club to golf ball, butt end, just little softies, just there, butt end. Very aggressive through impact, yet a short swing. Up, butt end, absolute pure. Three in a row, up, butt end, up, butt end. There we go, full on compression, no compression leakage, no early extension. There. Watch Justin Thomas, um, Justin Rose. What is he trying to do? Is he trying to do? Is he trying to do that? Something along those lines. Oh, good fun.